Hi, right, I thought it'd just be easier to film uh, this eBay listing. Um, basically, about eight months ago, I bought all of this gear to try and make up a, a temperature controller for a BGA rework project. Uh, in the end, I decided that uh, to use proper PID controllers and not mess around with the, uh, the Arduino uh, bits and pieces. So this is all uh, brand new and unused. Uh, I have a genuine Arduino Uno in here. So that I have connected it. I have messed around with some of the uh, uh, the display uh, projects just to uh, get my head around it all. But uh, apart from that, it's all remain unused. Uh, we have three of the uh, keypad shields. Uh, they're the, uh, the DF robot ones, all brand new. This one I've actually um, connected up and used on the Arduino. There are another two unused, one with the plastic cover on still and one without. Again, tested all of these when I uh, originally received them. So we've got three displays. Uh, the Arduino, we have a uh, 80 mega 328PU large kit with BL. I can't even remember what it was for, but, and you probably can't see this because of all the reflections. But it looks like there's either one or two full kits here to make up a standalone uh, Arduino on your own uh, circuit board. All the components are in there. It's unopened, so uh, that's that one. Uh, we have a, a four relay module again unused but tested originally um, so I can't remember how much that was but uh, uh, yeah that's the four relay pack we have a bunch of uh, what I call plug and socket uh, jumpers so some have got the pins and some have got the you know the actual sockets it's a bunch of those we then have a whole bunch of uh, ones with the pins on either end. So that's that. We have two Arduino books. We've got Simon Monk's uh, Getting Started with Sketches and uh, uh, Massimo Banzi. He's the co-founder of, of the Arduino and uh, that is his Getting Started with Arduino. I'm not even sure I've looked at these and they don't the books don't look like I've even opened them. Uh, so that's that. We then have two of the Adafruit uh, Max 31855 breakout boards. These are the little boards you need if you want to connect up uh, thermocouples uh, to the Arduino Uno. So there's two of those, brand new. We have a pack of three I think LM I think they're LM thirty fives let me have a look. Uh, yeah LM thirty fives these are the uh, temperature sensors that are used on a lot of the uh, basic Arduino projects. So there's three of those brand new not even been out of the pack. Uh, we have a spare 80 mega 328 PU not sure we can focus on that. I don't know whether you can see that, I'm looking through the uh, the, uh, the screen of the camera, but hopefully you can see that. We then have, I oh, know this isn't as associated with this lot, but I thought I might as well get rid of this as well. This is actually a programming lead for the uh, Pickaxe uh, setup, it's a Pickaxe serial download cable. Uh, if you're messing with Arduino, you might also be messing with Pickaxe, so I'm going to include that. That's uh, brand new and uh, unopened. Uh, we then have a, I think this is 5 volt power supply. You just connect a um, 12 volt power supply to this and then this just gives you 5 volts out for your Arduino projects. I have used that. Now we've then got a set of headers and you just you know, snap these off and pop them in the uh, the various circuit boards that you might be working on uh, like that. 
so yeah I can't remember how many there are there's probably 10 or so of those uh, this is a, a standalone prototyping board it's a, an RCAT 28 um, and that is from um, Oh, a company on the internet. I've just reviewed their one of their training kits, and I can't remember the name. RK Electronics. That might not be right. Best to have a look on the uh, my other YouTube videos. But yeah, brand new, unused prototyping board. Um, spaces for uh, SOIC ICs, whatever you want to uh, to put on that. Um, so that's that. And the last thing I think we've got is a large breadboard with. Uh, your supply connections here. I've actually added little rubber feet onto this one. I don't think it came with uh, those. Again, unused, but uh, I thought it was going to be useful. Um, but uh, none of this is being used, so it's a little point in having it all stuck in the workshop doing nothing. I think that's everything, and uh, yeah, the price you'll see, I'm just going to do it as a, I think a buy now probably. There's a lot of stuff there, if anyone's interested in getting started in the Arduino uh, system, then uh, there's a lot of stuff there to, uh, to get you going. Alright, thanks for watching.